Now, Rodrigo, where does actually Spain go from here? Are we going to see fresh elections? Well, um, the big question is whether we're going to see elections or not. Right away, that's not going to happen because they have a window of two months in which uh, somebody can come up with a solution and try to form a new government. They would have to request uh, the king to, to ask them to do so, but they have two months to negotiate. Whether they will or not reach an agreement is the big question mark. Now, if they don't reach an ag agreement by September 23rd, then the election process starts and there would be elections in November. Why is this so difficult and what options does Pedro Sanchez actually have? The national structure, there's basically four parties, two on the right, two on the left. The two parties on the right have said they will not help Pedro Sanchez govern under basically any terms. They would demand extremely hard terms for him to accept, especially regarding Catalonia. Um, he could govern, it's likely he could govern if he had support from Podemos, the party which is to the socialist left, he's socialist, but that's the party where he hasn't been able to agree with on what appear to be from the outside small issues. And it, it does seem to be coming down to a bit of a vanity fight right now. Um, they may try to brush those those problems out. If they can, that would be, that would be great to, uh, for them to form a government. But right now, that seems to be the crux of it.